Hi, I'm Sarah and I'll be presenting the paper Guaranteeing Safety of Learned Perception Modules via Measurement Robust Control Barrier Functions, which is joint work with my collaborators Andrew Taylor, Ryan Cosner, Ben Rest, and Aaron Ames. Cheap sensors and increasing storage and computational power enable robotic systems to incorporate increasingly complex sensing modalities like cameras. Moving from traditional sensors to more complex domains gives rise to challenges of calibration, or in other words, a misspecification of the measurement model. How do we ensure that complex and data-driven sensing can be used safely and effectively to control robotic systems? In this work, we propose measurement robust control barrier functions as a method for ensuring the safety of robotic systems with imperfect measurement models, especially those that arise from data-driven perception. We consider the setting of a nonlinear system with control affine dynamics. We further suppose that safety is encoded via a set in state, state space defined as a zero superlevel set of some function h. Our goal is to ensure that the system remains within this set. Finally, we suppose that the system state is observed through some complex and potentially high dimensional function, and that an approximate inverse function is known or has been learned from data we call this the perception module. A prevalent method for ensuring the safety of a nonlinear system is through the use of control barrier functions. These barrier functions work by the observation that this increase condition ensures that H remains positive over time, meaning that the system remains safe. This increase condition can be written in terms of the system dynamics, and for notational ease, we will use the Lie derivative. Using this condition to define a set of possible inputs allows us to certify the safety properties of a given controller or to synthesize control actions such that safety is guaranteed. While control barrier functions are a powerful tool for ensuring safety, they rely on exact knowledge of how the system will evolve and thus accurate state observation. We propose measurement robust control barrier functions, which are defined as follows, where A and B are non-negative functions of the observation. Compared with the standard barrier condition, there is an additional negative term on the left-hand side, which grows large for large inputs. This term captures the uncertainty in how the system will evolve. This set of robustly safe inputs can be used to modify any nominal controller using the following optimization problem. To see why the definition takes this form, consider the measurement model. We use observed measurements, y, to reconstruct an estimated state using a perception module Q hat, which approximates the inverse. This approximation results in measurement model error, which we assume can be bounded. Instead of requiring the increase condition at a single point, we robustify to the entire uncertainty set. The uncertainty set is characterized in terms of the prediction error of Q hat. Following this logic, we can use a measurement robust control barrier function to guarantee safety. As long as the perception errors are bounded by epsilon, and the barrier function and Lie derivatives are Lipschitz, then any controller in the measurement robust set KMR renders the system safe, where A and B are chosen as follows to depend on the Lipschitz constants and the error bound. How can we make sure that this set KMR is not empty? Well, it boils down to whether the errors are small enough. In our paper, we further discuss how data can be used to reduce measurement model errors and ensure feasibility of this problem. To illustrate the effectiveness of measurement robust control barrier functions, uh, we demonstrate their use on a realistic simulation of a Segway model. Safety is defined as a set dependent on the pitch angle and angular velocity. We suppose that measurements of the pitch angle and the horizontal position are available only through the camera. To train a learned perception module, we use a grid of training data ranging over positions and pitch angles. We learn a non-parametric map from image to position and pitch angle using kernel ridge regression with radial basis functions. Finally, we use the predicted pitch angle and position values from this map in closed loop by wrapping the control barrier condition around a PB controller. Due to the measurement errors, the nominal control barrier function condition fails to keep the system safe. However, the robust control barrier function condition is successful. In conclusion, our paper presents measurement robust control barrier functions to guarantee safety in the presence of measurement model error, proposes its use as a safety filter in an optimization-based controller, 
and relates the feasibility of the controller to the system continuity and perception module errors. See our paper for full details.